<laughs> you will not see me ever acting ever again. So many tears. Money is like poop bags. This is like big news. It was the most traumatic experience. <laughs> well, hi. Usually I say howdy, but you know what? I have been off of caffeine for... I guess this is the fourth day. Ew. Ugh. And I feel miserable. Anyway, this is going to be the start of what I think is going to be my Easter vlog. Something, something along the lines of Easter. I feel like Misty would like this maybe for Easter. Nah, this is my favorite color, but it doesn't smell like anything and it would just like sit there. I'm not paying $10 for this. There really isn't much Easter stuff. I fear I may have been a little late. I'm just kind of wandering around at this point. Look how cute these socks are with the little flag on the end. Is that not the cutest thing you've ever seen? Look, they have yellow shorts. I just found out some really, really wonderful news. And I'm so, so, so happy. I'm like walking around Target in like a happy days right now. I can't tell you what it is. It's not about the show. I don't even think I told you on YouTube about the show. I think I just posted on TikTok. But I still haven't heard back about that. But this... This, this is like big news. <sighs> Life is so good. This smells so good. I'm so getting this. How cute this is, this is very springy. Look how big these are. I don't know why, but I really want to get these big eggs and put things in them. And it looks like they're on sale too. So they're only $5. That's a deal. Oh my God, I love a good welcome. Guys, look at the welcome mats. I had a summertime mat, but I think I got rid of it when I moved out of Los Angeles. But this is for Easter. This is about Easter right now. Yeah, but they're on sale. I feel like everything's always on sale at Joanne's though. Oh, look who's waiting for me. I found so many good things in Joanne's. Very excited. I feel like this Easter basket is going to be super cute. Well, howdy. Wait, I need to make eye contact with you when I say hello. Well, howdy. I thought that it would be fun to do a like week in my life kind of video. So right now it's Monday, it's my day off. I have a couple places I need to go. If you look over here, you'll see all the packages I need to return. There's a lot of things. Plus there's a bunch of clothes I wanna donate. So we're gonna go do that. <laughs> snow is so weird it's just kind of like floating in the air feels like a very weird day i didn't realize it was snowing out today it started kind of sleeting last night when i went to go pick up books at target i really just wanted to reread akatar and also i hadn't actually finished i didn't read the last two books so i was like hmm what's the cheapest way to do this i got the whole series of akatar last night so i started rereading court thorns and roses clothes donated one of the packages said UPS, but it also says USPS. So he said he can't take it here. It has to go to USPS, which I was just at. Oh my God. My car does not do well in the snow at all. Oh, you know what? It's a weird day because today is like a lunar eclipse. Wait, no. There's an eclipse. I think it's a lunar eclipse. It's a full moon. Uh, so you tell me, you tell me. Okay, if they still sold this scent at Bath & Body Works, I would be getting 200 of these, but they don't. And I don't really have any good spring scents. I realized I use hand sanitizer like all the time. Oh, I think I kind of wanted to go into Lululemon because I realized with my job in the fitness industry, I get 25% off at Lululemon. I think I purchased one thing from Lululemon and I didn't like it. I think it was like a skirt or something last year. And I absolutely detested the customer service in here because they just straight up ignored me. Anyway, I kind of wanted to go to Barnes and Noble and like read, but because I want my period. Today's like a painful day. There's always one day where I'm just in immense amounts of pain. So that's how I woke up this morning. I'm doing better now, but also I can't drink coffee or eat anything. So I'm not really going out much. I don't know if I mentioned that, but I'm doing this like elimination thing that my doctor has me doing. She has me eliminating everything that I love. So I've been eating steak, potatoes, and green beans every single day for like the past two, two and a half weeks. Okay, we're here, bye.
Okay, so I went into Lululemon to find some work pants that I had seen online, but then I ended up finding some really comfortable gray sweatpants that fit like a charm. So now we're gonna go hit Bath and Body Works. Oh, that smells so good. <gasps> There's a Bridgerton. There's... Oh my God, this is all Bridgerton themed. Look at this. Oh, there's a clock tower right there. We got raspberries and whipped vanilla, crystal blue coast, endless weekend, sunlit palm trees, and pink pineapple sunrise. I'm gonna do crystal blue coast in here because that way we can do white, pink, light blue, then blue. It's all about the color coordination. Maybe let's put endless weekend in my purse and then one I can bring to work and one somewhere else. I don't I have so many. I think if you purchase books, they give you bookmarks. And I don't know where all of mine went. If I have to purchase a book, I have to purchase a book. Let's go look at the poetry. Who are we kidding? Mark my words. Someday, I'm going to have a book of poems on this shelf. I like this. I'm gonna get this. I think I'm gonna struggle making this as a weekly vlog because I've done like vlog a ween where I've had to like vlog every single day like every single detail of my life I think I need to get out of the habit of sharing too much I don't think we've even spoken about this but I am planning to move to Florida in the near future it's in the works it's on my mind and I'm going to be moving towards that I didn't get into Legally Blonde the musical which I auditioned for and got called back for and I was quite crushed about it so I'm giving up on that dream kind of sad honestly to say that out loud i just i've reached my breaking point and i just don't feel like trying anymore i was 99.9 percent .9 sure that i was gonna get cast in that show i'm over feeling rejected i'm over feeling sad and hurt and disappointed i'm like completely over it and i wish them all the best i hope they have a really great show but i'm just over it I'm over not being chosen or picked to be in things. I don't want to be stuck in the energy of trying. You know what I'm saying? I don't care if you're supposed to audition for shows to be in them. I, 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 that's not the kind of energy that I want in my life. I do not care anymore. You will not see me ever acting ever again. I'm just going to move on with my life and forget all about theater and acting and performing and all of that just screw it nobody wants me fine i don't want you now i kind of sound angry and jaded i just need to protect myself from getting hurt i've been hurt in so many different ways from so many different people and i just i want to live a life of peace it's just it's the end of an era Okay, I am driving to work. Hello. I'm trying out lipstick now to see if maybe it's gonna make a comeback in my life. I'm starting to think I'm more of a deep winter. First I thought I was autumn. Then I thought, I'm talking about color palette. Then I thought I was spring. Now I'm like, I think I'm a deep, deep winter. I took a really long nap yesterday. When I woke up from my nap, I got this email from this, I'm not sure what her title is, she, theater owner. I had asked her back when I was in the mood for auditioning for things. I had asked her if I could submit a video submission for Othello. She got back to me, she said, please submit a video submission if you would like to. Immediately when I saw that, I had just woken up from a nap. So I was like, screw this, I'm not doing that anymore. For some reason, now I'm doing it. It's, ah, God, it's such a love-hate relationship. I'm not getting my hopes up with this. I'm just memorizing a monologue. I memorized it this morning as I was doing my hair. Actually, I memorized it last night. Who are we kidding? I was so excited. This is what happens. This is what happens. I'm like, I'm never doing that again. Screw this, like, screw theater, like, whatever, because I'm so hurt. And then I get so excited about the next thing. And it's like, what a freaking whiplash. I've reached the point where this is the last thing I'm auditioning for. I'm not gonna try anymore after this because I'm probably moving to Orlando anyway. This isn't as high stakes to me because it's just a video submission. I'm thinking of just recording it tonight before I give myself too much time to worry about it. Anyway, I'm on my way to work, so see you later. 
totally forgot that I'm supposed to be vlogging my week. I should show you a clip of the video audition that I did last night for Othello. Because Justice! Oh, royal duke! Oh, worthy prince! Dishonor not your eye by throwing it on any other object till you have heard me in my true complaint and given me justice, 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 justice. Oh, hear me yourself. I'm currently breaking the rules of my doctor's diet, but my boss was treating everyone to Starbucks today and I'd be damned if I didn't get myself a little pink drink. Okay, look, I'm cute. I'm wearing pink, feeling cute. I'll see you later. Love you. Look at this, just enjoying the sunshine. On my break, I just started listening to Hosier, Hosier, Ho Hosie, Hosiers. How do you say that? Hosier's new album. It's so good. Ugh, love it. All right, happy Thursday, everybody. I am on my way to work. It's a 12-hour day today. Yesterday was a 10-hour day. Side note, this canvas bag that I got from Dagny Dover is great for the most part because of things being in these pockets that are heavy it kind of just like slumps the bag in on itself and then also this velcro came to me like broken like this and i asked somebody if i could get a new one sent to me and they were going to but then they realized they're sold out of this color so i'm looking at other bags that i can get i love having a big bag but it could be better it's not perfect Okay, I'm trying to scope out like what a good location would be to film this UGC content that I have to make. Just got a text from this producer that I used to work with in LA and he just sent me a request for a short video for an AI essay writing tool online. So I'm gonna make a quick video for 300 bucks, so easy. Well, howdy, it's the day before Easter. Oh my God, Easter's tomorrow. I have work today. I am setting up a table at Snooze. It's this brunch place. I've been helping out with sales because we don't have enough sales people. Why is my camera all blurry? Yes, I am wearing my scrub jacket from when I worked for a doctor. And no, I do not care because there's a slight chill in the air. And the company I work for now doesn't provide jackets for its employees. I just went to Dunkin'. This is my first coffee in over two weeks. I used to get this hazelnut white chocolate bark, or maybe it was hazelnut bark. I don't know where the bark came from, but they said they had white chocolate and they had hazelnut. So I just got a medium iced coffee with hazelnut and white chocolate. Oh man. That's just what I wanted. Ugh, good first sip back on coffee. Okay, you guys, I'm currently at Snooze. I set up this whole little table, so I'm just trying to mingle. <laughs> the sun's coming out. Kinda nice to get out of the pub every once in a while. Okay, sometimes I have these like manifestation epiphanies. Sounds kind of silly, but I literally just had one while I was grabbing a bunch of poop bags from the little poop bag station over there. Money? is like poop bags. I was just thinking about how we never run out of poop bags. You literally just get them as you need them. Misty, say hi. She hates technology. Now you're getting all tangled. Kind of. Money is like poop bags. Whenever you need some more, the universe always has spots along the way where you can get it. What is my point? My point is it's a better w mentality to think about money as if they were poop bags. See the money <laughs> as always there and always available, like the universe or the neighborhood or the HOA or wh whomever is always providing the money. Money will always be there to help you pick up the the poop like you can worry about it and be like oh do i have the poop bags on me like oh my god like i need to go out and buy the poop bags just because you like stock up on a bunch of poop bags doesn't mean that you're gonna be set for life does that make sense i'm trying to convince myself that it makes sense oh look missy a horse look at the horses you see the horses well good morning and happy easter I was debating whether or not I wanted to go to an Easter service this morning. However, I'm kind of a scaredy cat. I don't really know anyone else here who goes to church and I just, I don't know, it just, it's really intimidating and scary to me still because I've only been into the church like a couple times. And also it's just been a really long week. So I'm just kind of tired. Now I'm watching Misty. My parents left for a cruise yesterday. Oh, hello Misty. 
She's waiting for me to take her out. Okay, see ya. Look how cute this dog is. Look at him. Look how cute she is. Oh, will you want something? Oh, is there something you want over here? Okay, are you ready, Misty? Are you ready to go outside and run around? She's ready, she's ready. I literally just spilled my water down my back. <laughs> I was bending down with my purse, like, on my shoulder trying to find the tennis ball that's under my seat and it just spilled all over there in my back you good for nothing piece of trash oh misty you found it <laughs> i know i know we made it misty sit good girl look at her prancing go get it like a doctor with a stethoscope with this thing. Look at you! Look at you, happy girl! Go, Missy, go! Run, Missy, run! Go Thanks for carrying the ball, Misty. Appreciate ya. It is a beautiful day. The one great thing about Colorado is like, yes, I still have water soaking my back, but it's Colorado. So it's gonna dry up in like two seconds. Okay, who wants their windows down? I know I do. Hi, could I do a grande iced lavender oat milk latte? Could I get that with the lavender like cold foam on top? Yeah. And then, I feel that's a good combo. Is it? Okay, I wasn't sure. And then I'll also just do a pup cup, please. Okay, thanks. You wanna do a little taste test? Do a little taste test. Taste test. How was it? <laughs> Delicious. Okay, actually, last time you made a mess in here, so let's just wait till we get back home. Actually, wait, can you lick the rest of the top off? Careful. Ah! Misty, it spilled. Okay, I'm gonna taste test mine now. It doesn't look too appealing <laughs> because these colors just don't go great together. Oh, look at the bottom. It's like dark purple. Oh, so good. I love everything lavender. Bon appetit. Enjoy. Oh, you're so good, Misty. While she eats that, um, I'm gonna give myself this Easter basket. Look how cute it is. Here's what I got myself. My mom got me all of these. I got myself these big random Easter eggs. I don't know, they were just pretty. Then I also got myself these bunny ears. Misty, look at this. She's too preoccupied. Look how cute these are though. I got myself these little so I mean, I'm sorry, the Easter Bunny. The Easter Bunny got me this stuff. I feel like I already showed you all this when I went shopping for it. Ooh, Mandarin hibiscus. Misty, can you chew a little more quietly? I guess that's a no. Oh, it smells so good, smell it. Then I got myself a cute little spring planner. I have like a whiteboard calendar and then obviously I have stuff on my phone to remind me of things. So I don't really use a hard copy planner anymore. So I thought I'd get myself a smaller one. Then I also found these cute yellow shorts. Okay, somebody tell me what my color palette is because I thought this shade of yellow looked good on me. I feel like I just have a lot of pink and like acne. So it's hard, it's hard to tell. I thought these would be good because also I am hoping to move to somewhere where it's sunnier and these would be perfect for that kind of weather. Get it. Get a mist. There you go. Do you like it? You wanna play with your ducky? Mwah. Wait, is this a duck? This is a duck, right? Or is it a chicken? I think it's a chicken. Ah! Rawr! Rawr, Mizzy. Rawr. I have so much laundry to do today. Tomorrow is April 1st. That's crazy to me. I feel like so much has happened in this year. It's been a little over a year since I moved back to Colorado from LA and I feel like so much has shifted for me. I believe in God now. I have a full-time job that I'm proud of. I'm out of debt. I just feel like I've changed a lot. And I'm turning 27 in a couple of months. That's wild. Get it.
think it is. I love the smell of fresh, fresh parchment. Good morning, you guys. Today is Monday, April Fools. I had to leave Missy at home because I'm getting my blood drawn this morning. I was like sweating in there. Look. We tried like three different veins. See, this is why I don't donate blood. She was like, you have really small veins. And then she looked at my hands and she's like, the veins are better in your hands. And I was like, no, 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 no. I literally started tearing up because I had blood drawn out of my veins in Florida. And it was the most traumatic experience. <laughs> I'm literally like, I feel like I was on like a drop ride. I don't know. Nothing scares me as much as this. I, I can't really compare it to anything. We're going to go to Starbucks. I'm going to treat myself. And then we are going to go back home to Misty. I totally forgot about this part. Spoiler alert for A Court of Wings and Ruin. But I totally forgot their dad. <laughs> like, their dad is the one who found Vasa. Vasa. Now I'm just thinking about the gym. So many tears. Okay, you guys. Where's the camera? I didn't realize I didn't film an outro, so this is my outro. I don't know what I'm filming next, but hopefully something interesting. If it's not interesting to me, I'm not going to want to edit it. You have to watch it so many times. How do I end these? How do I usually end this? Thanks for watching my video and I'll see you in the next one. That's how I usually end them, right? So thanks for watching my video and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>